Crafting Vicky here with you and I just finished a card making session where I used some of the beautiful painty papers that had been sent to uh, me uh, by Frances and made by one of her grandkids and so I figured I had some leftover scraps might as well just use them and what better way to use them but to make some ATCs and some twinkies so um, that's what we're doing and in the process I had an extra little piece of this and somehow I misplaced it so I have no idea where it is where it went it just disappeared on my desk um, like stuff always does I wonder oh there it is there they are that's what happens too sometimes I have a flash of where did I put them and there they were okay so that's perfect because that's exactly what I needed um, so one of the things that I thought I would do was use, for example, this here and uh, I'm going to cut out the white piece and uh, put this down they're going to be simple because why not? I mean, I don't have to make them super complicated. Um, one of the things that I thought with this one was to use a sentiment. So I have some some uh, words here that I that could be good uh, to play with, and they're all small little. Uh, oh, I like that creative and curious. That's pretty cool. And I have this left over here, so I could put those on, on top of that, and that would work. So let's let's do that. So before I cut it out, I'm gonna put tape on it. This way it will be easier. And uh, I'm gonna go glue that down. And I could just cut, well actually just use scissors. Even if it's not perfectly straight, I don't think it really matters. And voila! First little ATC made, very simple. This could actually make a really fun card topper. I know we said, um, um, I said I was going to make ATCs, but let's make, let's make a card out of this one. <laughs> just because, why not? I just think it would be a perfect card. Yes, indeed. So, well, at the end of the day, you're getting an extra card video. <laughs> But that's what happens when you start being creative and you're just playing and, and having fun ideas will will come along and plans will change and things will just go and that's exactly what happened here so let's uh, do that and then i can just put that right down there And instead of being a little ETC, it just turned out into a card. But how easy is that? So basically you can make a bunch of these and then I use them as card toppers and you would have a bunch of different uh, fun things, uh, which gives me the idea that I could do a bunch of these and scan them and, and then <laughs> and then make the, have them made into card toppers. That would be fun. Okay, so that was unexpected, but fun. And uh, so let's get going with this uh, card making session because yeah, you, you never know. You never know what's gonna come out of it. So we're just gonna cut this down here. How fun was that? 
<laughs> I'm anxious to, to know what you thought about it. Would you have done it into a card or not? And then uh, put this. there and uh, like that saying a journey of a thousand miles starts with a single step and th this is uh, some magazine clippings um, they're very Limsy magazine, like it's Woman's World or something like that. Very, very thin. Um, but they do have amazing sayings. And I had gotten a box uh, at a garage sale. Somebody was donating books of their magazines, and I had gotten all of them. And uh, spend. I, I think I still have a few left to um, to harvest but not many uh, one time at camping that's all I did which reminds me that I'm going camping again this year and I think I'm gonna bring some more magazines and do that because it'd be fun okay so for that one Thinking this could be nice using some music paper. Some of the music paper that I had, um, either that or I use textbook paper. more music to show up. So maybe something like this. not going to be a very long video but I just wanted to have a play and use up some of the leftover pieces that I had on my desk because I didn't want to I didn't want to put them away so might as well use them that's one of my favorite ways of um, of storing stuff, of putting things away is to do another video because then I get to use up the stuff and I don't have to put it away This one has tape, so I'm not sure I'm going to be able to use the tape, but... I'm thinking like that.
And again, using the tiniest little scraps because why not? I still want to see some of the, the music. I think I'm going to layer it on top. And here we go. Um, then we have the little blue left over. And so for the blue, I have one dark blue here. So I could use that one or let's use this piece. And then I'm thinking, what do I have? Why not this one? Uh, I should use tweezers. <laughs> that would be the smarter way of not putting my fingers all over the glue. I'm going to glue the top part. Yep. Here we go. And then we've got this one left. Um, so let's do two little, two little. cheese don't remember how they're called but whatever you know what I mean
here and uh, the right colors too, which is perfect. Here we go, using the tiniest little pieces left. like that one. Relax and have fun. Whoops, 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 whoops. What happened there? and have fun. Here we go. So that will be the last of these. Uh, but we make quite a few and I've used up quite a lot of the little tiny little scraps. I was able to use some of my words so that's pretty awesome. And uh, here we go. So we've actually got a card made as well as uh, three ATCs and two little uh, toonies. <laughs> uh, it would be, they're a little bit high, bigger than the, um, than the toonies, but not that much. Um, so yeah, so that's it guys. I hope you've enjoyed. Now I've got less little scraps to pick up, which is great, and I love you guys so much. Bye.